Hey, good day, happy honeybees. Today, we are on Roblox Bloxburg because I'm gonna be showing you guys two different ways to make vines on Bloxburg. If you are excited for this video, then make sure to hit that like button and make sure to hit that subscribe button for fun Roblox videos. And to be first to all of our new videos, then hit that notification bell too. But anyways, let's get started with the video. Also, make sure to watch until the end because the second way I'm going to be showing you guys is definitely my favorite way. I think it is the best way and I don't see a lot of people doing it, but I definitely think it is a great option. So you guys should definitely keep watching to find out how to do that. Anyways, the first way I, is one I see a lot, but I want to show you guys anyways because um, some people might not know. And the first thing you want to do, of course, is to get your wall. You might already, you probably already have a house and just pretend like this is a wall in your Bloxburg house. Make sure color it white real quick. And the next thing you want to do is you want to go to decorate. Go to decorations and just search search up painting. And you want to get the plain painting set. You want to get the the plain large painting or whatever size painting you want. I just recommend this one. You want to put this on your wall wherever you want your vines to be. I'm just gonna put it right here for as example. So now you want to go over to your painting and you want to click change picture. And you want to go to search and search for vines. And then there'll be some pictures. For example, I like to use this one right here. And this one's a pretty good one. And there also are some other cute ones as well. And if you don't find one here that you like, you, don't, you can also search up this vine. And there are different search results depending on which one you search up. So you can also use this one, for example. But you can choose whatever one you want to use and whichever one you like. So I'll just use this one as an example. And there you go, that's the first way. And you can also change your wall um, color to match the background of the picture. But that is the first way to make vines in Bullocksburg. So the second way is something different, again, that I haven't seen used very much before, but I definitely think that it is the better way to make vines. So what you want to do is you want to go to the build section, you want to go to structural, and you want to select the standard square beam. Then click on that, you want to select the standard square beam, and then click Right now it's a standard placement, click on it so it says custom placement. Change the grid size to be like um, this one so that you can move it around. But you want to first off create just like a line, however wide you want the vines to be. And then start and click like right here wherever your um, line is and just move it downwards like that for example. Then do another one to move like that way kind of. And you can basically just create your vines however you want. It is completely up to you. You can just make them kind of like have like, just like, you know, just moving, like just kind of having um, just lines to make it look like vines. You, if you mess up, you can also click the undo button like that. And just make it look like the vines are just, again, just moving like that. And you can change this around until you like how it looks. Okay, so I've got a shape that I like. So this is an example of a shape you can do. Again, just kind of do however you want. It's just, if you don't like it, then try again and eventually get a shape that you like. So it should look something like this. And then what you want to do is you want to get the paint. You want to click on one of these and you want to select the color sage green, which is over here. Yep, right here. You want to click on that. And then from the material, you want to select the grass color. And then you want to color all these. If you're on a computer or laptop, if you hold down shift, and then you click, you can click and color everything. So that's, uh, that's something I like to do. And then this is the color. Again, you can adjust the color to how you would like it, but that definitely is a good way, like a good color for these in my opinion. Here is a final comparison of how both methods look side by side. This one over here is the first method and this one over here is the second method. Comment below which one you guys like better. I personally like the second method better because you have more creative freedom on where you want the vines to be. Cause like, if you wanted them to be like, like super long then you can do them super long if you want to be super super short then you can make them super short it's all up to you but anyways i make leave a comment on which vines is your favorite thank you all so much for watching if you enjoyed then hit that like button and subscribe for more fun roblox videos if you want to be first to our newest videos then make sure to hit that notification bell too comment down below whether you like the first method or the second me method of making vines on blocks work better if you want to watch more fun Bloxwork videos, there will be some links in the description to more fun Bloxwork videos and playlists. Or if you play other games such as Star Stable or other Roblox games such as Royal High or Adopt Me, there are also playlists to those fun videos. But definitely go check those out. You'll find something you'd love to watch. Anyways, have an amazing day everyone and bye you guys!